you fight him like four times throughout the game, and every time he just wipes the, the floor with you, seriously. With that psychotic, got that. Like, turns his head into an axe and I cut you in half. Just, oh, Carnage just wants you dead, essentially. Oh, he's, he's a, a hardcore it, bastard. That his Carnage. name's Carnage, for Christ's sakes. Hey, I got what you want, you know? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I expect nothing um, less. <laughs> uh, it's kind of weird. These, these three are kind of all um, based on franchises. The second, these number six, for me, would be Starscream from the, uh, tran from the PlayStation 2 Transformers game. I think I remember that game. When, the, yeah, it, it's just great. But it's it's in the second level, and this is how the saying is that like, the Starscream fight is harder than all the other fights combined. And like you fight him twice, but the first one is much harder. Basically, second level, you're in like um like Alaska or some shit like that, and like you're walking towards you these like buildings, which compared to the Transformers aren't really big. <laughs> fucking expose! Starscream just comes at you like he gets out his sword and just goes prepare for extermination and just like charges at you, and he just fucking like kicks your ass. It's insane. Um, number five, uh, you know, that Shredder from, from Turtles in Time. Oh, and, yeah. You know, it's like in the, the, the Muto, the, let me say this correctly, the Muto, Re no, fucking, the, <laughs> the, the, the gun that turns you back into a yeah. turtle. Yeah. That just, you know, the one hit kill, just, oh my god, no, man. Especially when he turns Super Shredder, it's just, oh, that's just evil. Evil. Um, number four, Battle Toads. Just Battle Toads. The, whole game. <laughs> the cartridge. Just the whole game. The cartridge man. count. That's just, the boss. Just, 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 just the car. Like, like, just, 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 just finding the courage to put that game into your NES, because you know you won't get past level three. <laughs> Just put it in there just so you can get like what seven minutes of gameplay before you finally just think fuck it I'm not gonna get any further I'll play Mario 3 again. <laughs> Battle told you absolute bastard. Uh, number three would be Anthem from Kingdom Hearts 1. Mm. Literally I spent six hours on that boss. Six hours. And what do I get in the end? Uh, Kingdom Hearts is light. <laughs> Thanks for that. Just so I, I'm here busting my ass off, and all I had to do was open the door that's behind me to kill him. That's all I had to do was just turn around, six, you know, 180 degrees, walk five foot, open the door. Ah, uh, you dick. Yeah, leave it to, leave it to Square so, Enix. I think um, number number two is a boss that I think everyone can relate to from a little game called Diddy Kong Racing. A, a little <laughs> fat bastard called Bud Whiz Pig. I remember Diddy Kong Racing. And, no, not only, not only does does Wig, does Wiz Pig start the race before you do. Not only does he run on two and not three, that fat cheating shit. Not only does he do that, but after you defeat him, they give him a fucking rocket. It's like if he wasn't fast enough before. Well, if you if, what would they think? No. If you wanna win, you gotta earn it, I guess. He leaves before you're allowed to be the kiss of fucking rockets! <laughs> fucking rockets! Bastard! All of them. Rare. Rare, you know. <laughs> Banjo Kazooie, nuts and bolts. Good job, bro. Oh, we'll get on that topic later. <laughs> um, and, and number one, this is a boss that ever since I played this game, you know, this, this is honestly, um, not many bits of music. With, with the exception of maybe like the uh, the Halloween theme yeah. from the movie Halloween, not many bits of music will make me scared or just make me think, <laughs> oh shit. But but the music for the boss I'm about to tell you, every time I hear it, I just think, oh shit, I'm Wait, gonna the die. Music from what? Even uh, I'll get to it in, in a second, but like if I'm on a bus and it's because it's on my iPod, I don't know why because it scares me shitless. If I'm on my iPod and I'm like on a bus going into town and it comes on, I just jump up and scream. <laughs> It's like, oh fuck, no, he's gonna kill me. Essentially, what, what, what I'm referring to is, is, alright, he's green, he's scaly, he wears a pirate hat, he has a big fucking musket that not only shoots cannonballs, it shoots barrels, different types of gas that make you turn in the opposite direction, make you slow. Not only that, man, but he steals your bananas. Am I, am I thinking? I'm of course referring 
to King K. Yes. Rool from Donkey Kong Country 2. In one, he's a pushover. You give it two minutes, you know what to do. But Donkey Kong Country 2, fuck me out of my ass. Is that last boss hard? Alright, well, that's a. <laughs> just, just, just. No, I mean, uh, and that, that music just the way it starts. To... I hear that, and I just, I just start to wet myself. So, oh god, he's gonna kill me again. Well, that, that was FTA's top 10 hardest bosses. And uh, thank you, thank you for helping me with that. <laughs> I won't be able to sleep tonight, night, you bastard. Yeah, well.